I'm sure the thinking is that Senate cannot impeach us, Senate were not answerable to them. As far as we had these meetings and we keep discussing about the prices, the prices don't go come down. Chair, I would uh, clearly say there's no need of even inviting them moving forward after the essential motion because it is an exercise in futility. P.S. Unfortunately, we don't have uh, we, we don't have reason to listen to you because it's a summons and we had summoned the C.S. Uh, Charles Keter ministry. We will have no intention of writing the, any invitation from the National Assembly or the Senate. And indeed, we have never done so, and we will not do it. Uh, at this time, when Kenyans are uh, facing this particular crisis, I don't think we require any representation. We want to deal with people who are directly concerned and in charge of, uh, of their ministries. We are actually paid because Kenyans are actually suffering. Because of electricity in this country, we all know. In fact, personally, I'm a corporate. I, I have a pump for pumping water, if just for cattle. And I'm paying nearly 800,000 a month. More expensive than a cattle. Yeah, a cattle costs 150,000. I'm telling you, it's high time you people in the ministry liberalized and they allowed Kenyans to go to solar. I'm thinking seriously of going to solar. Anyway, to our dear lady who is now learning Kenya power, uh, uh, you know, we, we, we wish you well. We will give you support where we can. We want to cooperate with you in trying to bring back this dying horse. But I must say the committee has unanimously passed the, the solution or the judgment that a fine be imposed upon the cabinet secretary of 500,000 shillings. And uh, we hope that this matter will come.